Hey, what is going on, everybody? My name is Sir Legit, and I welcome you to my new Elgato Game Capture HD fixing tutorial thing, Bob. Whatever you want to call it. I hope you guys have found this video super, super nice and neat, super quick, and all that stuff. But, um, anyways, so this is going to be in relation to the Elgato Game Capture HD stuttering in game video stuttering what your Elgato is outputting to your computer. It decides to start stuttering over time. Make sure this is with OBS as well. And uh, I don't have Aereo disabled, so there's going to be a bit of a lag going around when it's uh, when I'm moving stuff around. Anyways, luckily we won't be moving stuff around all that much unless we go like that. But we're not going to. So let's go ahead and throw this on over here. And uh, anyways, so we have the Elgato. We have the you know what it's disabled. Or we have it over here. This is what my this is what my Elgato is capturing right now. Just so you guys can have it here in the screen, I'm not going to be performing any kind of like stuttering or whatsoever in the video, just because I've already fixed it and I don't want to wait three hours for it to actually start happening. Um, hopefully, this is in the same problem that you guys are going to be having. Uh, this is with this is the problem I was having while streaming. I'm sure this would happen uh, with local recording here on OBS as well. Um, I'm not exactly sure if this happens in local recording, but it probably does. If you haven't have the, if you don't have these settings set already. So, anyways, let's go ahead and get a jump start on how to stop stuttering and audio desync on the Game Capture HD Elgato. Um, so, go you go ahead and jump into your settings. First of all, you go you go to settings, settings. Even though you should just click on settings and it would take you to settings, but there's other settings under settings. You go to your advanced tab on the left side of your settings screen. Make sure your scene buffering time is 700. I know Twitch tells you, if you're live streaming, Twitch tells you to set it to 400. But if you're using the Elgato Game Capture HD, make sure you set it to 700. I'm not sure exactly why this even makes much of a difference. Um, if you want to ask questions to someone else, like one of the developers over at OBS, uh, to a I asked them why why would a measly 500 millisecond difference stop stuttering? I have no idea, but it has fixed the problem. Um, luckily, it has because I get tired of having to stop my stream before it started stuttering. Because guess what? The stream was utterly useless. You couldn't even enjoy it because it was just like. Uh, 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 uh. It was bad. It was really, really bad. So I decided to spend days and days dealing with it and having to stop the stream f just before three hours, um, just because of the audio, or not just just because of the in-game video output stuttering that the Elgato was producing. To OBS, this is OBS's kind of problem, but USB devices always are kind of slow. You know, especially if they're not in the USB 3.0. But I don't know of any Elgato that can actually work properly in a, in a USB 3.0. They may, they may. You guys may know that more than I do. But anyway, so the scene buffering time set milliseconds 700. Please set that to that. And if you're having this problem, if if this doesn't fix it, then you may have another problem with this. So I suggest going to OBS and posting as well. And if it's the same issue, you, maybe your computer needs more scene buffering time. Maybe it needs less. I don't know. You can just do your test. Unfortunately for me, it's not very easy to test with my problem because I had to wait three hours before it started happening. So I had to make sure that I strained for at least three hours to make sure that there was no more stuttering. Luckily, there was no more. Uh, so it's no, no longer existent for me. Thank God. So now let's go ahead and move on to the audio desync. Uh, first of all, you got to have your Elgato. Make sure if you're streaming to Twitch. Um, they are even just in OBS in general. I think it, it doesn't even have to be streaming to Twitch. In local recording, make sure you have your Elgato set as a global device, please, or global source. Excuse me. The way you add, go about adding, <clears throat> the way you go about adding a global source, you go ahead and add. After this pops up, when you click on global sources, you add a capture, add a video capture device. You type in the name. Farbadarbadar, whatever it is. I don't know. I'm not going to keep it because I already have it, obviously. Then you go to your devices and you can select your Elgato Game Capture HD and, you know, select it, configure it, even though when you press configure it doesn't open anything. Um, set your custom resolution to whatever you want. You don't even have to. 
uh, it doesn't make a difference. Make sure you have the use under the video section, the use buffering milliseconds enabled. Check that box. Make sure it stays at zero. This should this should keep it from losing sync over time on the Elgato from gameplay video uh, or gameplay input from the Elgato. It should it should no longer lose sync with gameplay because without this being enabled. Again, it has to do with the USB 2.0 devices being too slow to actually transfer this kind of quality um, and staying at a steady pace. So you tell the o you tell OBS to kind of, hey, keep it in line. So it does. Um, luckily, again, I streamed for three hours straight. All of it stayed clean and smooth. So this does actually fix them. So make sure you have use buffering enabled. Set that to zero. Make sure that your audio off sync is you know set to uh, set to uh, bear, 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 uh, zero as well sorry uh, my brain farts um, so again I don't know don't try and ask questions because I don't know why this video under the video section has an input towards audio desync go ask OBS developers I'm not sure they assisted me on the forums very much so the link to the thread if you want more of an explanation, I guess I get from it's just in plain text instead of video. Uh, go, there's a, there's gonna be a link in the description down below that'll take you to the take you to the thread that I had started and ha I started getting assistance from Jim, the developer, one of the developers at OBS. He assisted me ever so kindly. We had a couple little misunderstandings every now and again, but hey, everything was good. We all both have you know kind of understood. We're like, well, we didn't state this at first. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But anyways. So if, if you want to go there and get a text format of how to fix this and understand more, I guess, uh, from him himself, then you can go ahead and do that. It's in the link in the description down below. Take you to the straight to take you straight to the thread. Anyway, so this hopefully should stop the audio desync and stuttering if this is the same problem that I was having. Hopefully it is, and um, your problem is solved immediately because uh, this took me a few days, which is fine. You know he has a job. He's he's a human being as well, just like me. I'm a human being as well. You know I can't sit at my computer 24/7. Oh, you got this problem? Tap 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 tap. Done. Problem solved. It's not like that. So, anyways, hope this helps, guys. If it did, go ahead and leave the video a like, a double like, fist bump, whatever you want to do. I don't know. <laughs> it's whatever you want to do. If you're also not subscribed, go ahead and do so as well. And. uh it's much appreciated, much appreciated. As well as you can go to my twitch.tv forward slash Sir Legit and follow me there when I am live. Uh, remember though, this is for the Elgato. This is this is not for any other game capture device. If I mean, you can try this stuff. I don't know if any of those other devices have this kind of problem. I'm not sure if it's just my computer. I doubt it. But uh, anyways. I will catch you guys in the next YouTube video or if you join me in the stream. Remember to hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't done so already, and even favorite the video and make sure you please share it to others that are having this issue. I could not find this this kind of helpful tip video on YouTube anywhere, no forms. There was other stuttering, image stuttering and gameplay and audio and all that stuff, but never was it the same as mine. I'm hoping that everyone else that has this problem gets it solved from what I've just told you in this video today. My name is Sir Legit. I cannot add this source because I already have one. Um, and I hope you hope I hope this assists you guys. Make sure you leave it in the comment section below. Hopefully it helps. If you have any other questions, I could try my best to assist you. But leave it in the comment section down below. And I will catch you guys in the next video or on Twitch.tv. I will see you guys there and have a good day. See you guys later.